Hey everybody, this is my benchtop bench that Russ saw in my first video and expressed interest in. So I'd like to show it to you. Boy, if you could see my camera set up right now. Ah, uh, let's see here. Let me get the drawers out of here. There's the bare bench. And here are three good reasons to not put any doggles in your bench until you use it for a while. But now they're an accent piece. This is a planing stop or a sanding stop. It just uh, fits into these back dog holes and covers them up. I guess since the drawers are out, let's talk about them. This, this drawer I just added this week. And for me, I just keep all of the tools that I would normally use very often within easy reach. It holds it in with some rare earth magnets which don't work that well. So I added some Velcro. Gives it a little more stick, but not much. I'm still not real happy with that. And I also have a couple of, there's a plastic screw right here that screws in. And they ride in that slot and they prevent the door, drawer, they prevent the drawer from coming out. Now you leave that locked down pretty much all the time. So I'm going to tighten those up. These are just plastic screws by the way, so nothing's getting damaged. And of course I keep my screwdrivers, a square, a ruler, quick uh, caliper, some pencils and a marker, lead for the pencils, and a couple of blades, razor blades. And I'm sure I'll add to that over time, but that's what I'm keeping in here now. This other drawer, I keep all my sharpening stuff in. This was my first drawer, and it was kind of cumbersome to use all the time. So uh, that's the whole reason I built this other drawer. And then my latest addition, that's the video I just put up, uh, well I just put up, is this. The Stanley uh, 80-702. And what's great about this little gizmo is, uh, man, it's handy. It's light. It's very lightweight. It's made of aluminum. You can set it up to where it is. This surface here is flush with the bench. And that allows you to put in a piece of wood and have it flush with the, the bench. You can stick another clamp on here and hold it and then you're rock solid. Or you can stand one up here. And plane. But I've always felt like that's a little, not as easy as this. Now, again, all right up here, easy to work.
One thing I did want with my mini bench was the ability to slide it around the bench wherever I needed it. But it also needs to lock down. What I did, where I made these little fold down dogs, and they fit in the front dog holes. But they had a, the, uh, they started to work their way up as I used the bench and eventually come out and then the bench would move. So I came up with a couple of small pins just to hold those down. Now it is rock solid. Well, that's my bench. Thanks for stopping by and having a look. If you have any questions about it, something I didn't cover, why just let me know and I'll I'll answer them in the comments. But it's a great bench. I can't imagine uh, not having it. I'll just put it over here where it normally resides. Anyway, thanks again for stopping by. Have a good one. See ya.